Hey, I'm Brandon with Revzilla, joined here by my buddy Pat, and we are taking a closer look at the Merlin Hendrix riding shirt available at Revzilla.com. So the Hendrix riding shirt, as you can see, this is definitely a bit more on the casual side of the spectrum. It's a flannel design. You've got some DuPont Kevlar on the inside for your abrasion resistance, and you also get D3O armor at the shoulder as well as the elbow. But this is something that's going to be a bit more on the casual side of the spectrum, obviously. Um, and I think it's a little bit better to be worn when it's a little bit cooler out there. It does have some vents on it, which we'll talk about in just a moment. Uh, but I think it's going to run a little bit warm in the summer months, just considering you do have that DuPont Kevlar on there. Just something to keep keep in mind. Now before we get rolling, let's talk about the overall fit. I've got Pat here. He's about uh, 5'11", 220 pounds with a 44 inch chest. He is currently wearing a size large. He typically wears a size large in all of Merlin gear and this is fitting him perfectly. Now just something to keep in mind, if you reference that sizing chart, that 44 is going to put him in the XL. However, I'd probably recommend if you're in between two sizes, going with the smaller of the two, just knowing how well this fits him. It's not overly snug, but it's not overly relaxed. So so just something to keep in mind there. The large is fitting him very well with his measurements. Now, of course, this riding shirt will ship to you for free. And as always, we do have our price match policy in place. That, of course, is going to guarantee you the lowest price available. Let's start here at the collar. One thing I always look for for a more casual uh, style as this, uh, I do like to have those snaps here at the collar. I'll just leave that there. But if you've ridden with a button up shirt and it doesn't have the snaps uh, or a button there, it will whip you in the neck and it is not comfortable, especially at highway speed. So we do have that little bit of a textile material here just for styling purposes, but it is going to give you a little bit of additional abrasion resistance technically. And again, we do get that D3O armor here at the shoulder, and you're also going to get that at the elbow as well. A little bit of a patch here at the back of the elbow, and you do get that impact protection. Now, as we work our way down to the cuff, we've got a, a snap closure here on the cuff, and then a simple zipper there as well. I will say the cuff does feel very snug in this particular area. Just keep that in mind with this shirt. So if you have large forearms, ah, that's just something to consider. It will relax a little bit, but it is Kevlar, you know, and it is more of a flannel design, so it's not going to break in like leather is going to. Just keep that in mind. Now at the chest, we do have some vents here, but again, you know, knowing that you've got that Kevlar underneath here, you can actually see that. That is going to help with just the overall breathability here, but it's not going to give you a ton of direct airflow since these are the only two vents here. So I don't think this is going to be the best option in the prime heat of the summer. Two chest pockets, and then we've got two hand warmer pockets on both the left and right hand side as you get closer to the waistline. Now, Pat, go ahead and face that direction for me, sir. Strike that riding position. And as you can see, not a whole lot going on here at the side. Again, you can get a better look at that elbow patch there that you've got on the shoulder and that same material on the collar. Now, one of my little nitpicks, I would have loved to see a little bit more relief stitching. There's a little bit here, but it's not very large. I think that just would have helped with the overall comfort in that riding position. And then as we work our way down toward the bottom of the shirt, we do have a little Merlin logo there as well. Now, Pat, go ahead and face the back for me, sir. Now, as you can see, um, you know, not a lot going on here. You don't have any blacked out reflectivity or anything like that. Again, this is definitely more of that casual style here. No back protector is included, but you do have a pocket on the inside of this riding shirt, so you can easily add a back protector if you wish to do so. And you do have some good length at the back as well to give you that additional coverage. Now, Pat, go ahead and face the front for me, sir. As you can see, we've got a button and zipper main entry for the riding shirt, just some additional integrity there. And then as you can see, we have that mesh on the inside. Now, as you can see, if I pull that tight, I'm not sure if you can see it on the camera or not, but you can see that yellow liner under there. That is that DuPont Kevlar, and that is throughout the entire riding shirt itself. You will have a short connection zipper as well as a belt loop uh, with this particular riding shirt, which is always nice. So you can pair this up with a set of riding jeans or riding pants uh, and make sure you have that appropriate protection. Pat, you can go ahead and zip that up for me, sir. If you're looking for something that's casual, that's lightweight, you know, got that flannel design, this is the Merlin Hendrix for you. Now, of course, if you have any additional questions, you're looking for more details, please do not hesitate to reach out to us. You can click that info button. That's going to take you over to Revzilla.com where you can read other rider reviews. And as always, you can reach out to our gear geeks. Give them a call at 877-792-9455 or simply shoot over an email, cs at Revzilla.com. Thanks for hanging out with Pat and I for a bit and checking out the Merlin Hendrix riding shirt. I'm Brandon. Keep it pinned.